our local MP, Peter Heaton Jones, who's here to both open the gala and also to launch the 762 project. So I'll just pass you over to Peter to say a few words. Thank you. Uh, Peter, thank you very much indeed. Ladies and gentlemen, if I can add to Peter's welcome here to Woody Bay, but also to those who've travelled a long distance. I know there's many people who come here from further afield. Welcome to North Devon, where the sun always shines, and we always organise blue skies for events such as this, and it never rains on important occasions. Remember that and tell your friends that there is one group of people here who deserve so much praise and acknowledgement, and that is all the many volunteers who work so hard at the Linton and Barnstable to make this work, to make these sorts of days a success. Without further ado, it's my absolute pleasure to officially launch this £1 million project at the Linton and Barnstable to recreate the Yo and the X, and with that, to bring another plank in the floor, if you like, of the foundation of the major expansion scheme that the Linton and Barnstable has. We will soon have four and a half extra miles of track here, all the way back to Whistland Pound uh, and to Blackmore Gate, meaning an even bigger attraction for people here in North Devon. And with thanks to everyone who makes this possible, it's my absolute pleasure to launch this project and a new generation for the Linton and Barnstable Railway. Thank you very much indeed. September 2018 Autumn Gala on the Linton and Barnstable Railway, one year after we launched Lynn, uh, our new build that we started some seven years ago. Uh, and now it's time to start all over again. So the 762 Club uh, has resurrected itself to take on two new projects, which is Project Yo and Project X. Uh, and that's our mission to bring two new build Linton and Barnstable Railway Manning Wardles back onto the line. Um, the, this project will focus more on the Manning Wardle trademark that the Linton and Barnstable Railway Trust owns and we foresee that the project will take about five years uh, and in that five year period we anticipate raising just over a million pounds to build the two new locomotives. Um, we're obviously spurred on by the success that we've had with Lynn uh, and the faultless performance that she's given in service over the last 12 months uh, and we look forward to delivering another high quality two locomotives uh, to the Linton Barnstable Railway. Obviously in the process of making the two new locomotives we'll take the uh, opportunity where it applies to think about the further two locomotives uh, that could follow on after that. That would be Project Tour and Project Lou and where appropriate and where we can make the patterns uh, we will consider making four items of everything to, uh, to help feed into those new build locomotives. So, uh, I hope you look forward to the journey uh, with me again for another five or six years uh, and let's just continue to recreate the Linton of Art School Railway. Thank you very much John, very interesting. Um, I suppose I'll have to find some more money to invest in another engine but thank you and for what you do, really appreciate it.